New York state leaders hoping to speed up the process to get asylum seekers their work authorizations. The governor is saying the permits would help integrate migrants into the economy while alleviating labor shortages in the state. Our Capitol correspondent Jamie DeLine tonight has more on that story. The number one answer to this crisis is work authorization. For months, Governor Kathy Hochul has been calling on the federal government to speed up the process that allows asylum seekers to get jobs. And she's not the only one. Senator Chuck Schumer, along with other Democratic New York congressional members, sent a letter to President Biden in May calling for the 150 day employment authorization waiting period to be eliminated for those who have submitted their asylum applications. Even local government officials, such as Albany Mayor Kathy Sheehan, is calling on the federal government to act. We need workforce. We want individuals to be able to be successful. We want them to pay taxes. We want them to pay rent. We want them to be able to support themselves and their families. And in order to do that, Washington needs to fix this. Despite pleas from New York leaders in all levels of government, a change hasn't happened. There are so many jobs that we could put people in tomorrow. 5,000 farm jobs open right now. We're approaching the harvesting season. It's been really hard for our farmers. So people want to work. We need the legal status for them to work. And let's get them the jobs. And then they can be independent of needing supported services in New York City or elsewhere, because hopefully this is very temporary. That's the answer I'm still waiting an answer. I'm wait that's the question I'm still waiting an answer to. Have not received it, but I think that is going to change the whole dynamic uh, dramatically. Also in May, the New York Farm Bureau issued a statement saying in part, quote, we support Governor Hochul's request to the federal government to expedite work visas for migrants who have been properly processed and who want to work on farms in New York State. Reporting in Albany, I'm Jamie DeLine. Meanwhile,